Hey everybody, it's Blue Todd, and welcome back to Plants vs Zombies. And now, I have to explain something quickly because to get all the achievements, we need to have the all, we have to get all the trophies in the mini games, which we've done so far for the mini games and the puzzles. But survival is also part of that with an extra ten trophies, which could be difficult possibly. But I'm gonna do my best. So let's go into survival day, because there's there's all these different survival modes. So. But I think the survival is basically a lot like um, Last Stand, where we actually pick our plants, put them down, and we only have a set of- no wait, no we have- we do, we do have sun, but we can only- we have to survive a certain amount of rounds, I guess, I don't know. Well, we'll, we'll find out. Uh, but also, I want to get the Colonel Cobb Cannon achievement, which I can't do here because there's no gargantuas though, which is going to be the main problem for this, so. Uh, anyway, let me go absolutely insane and <laughs> do this stuff, because why not? Oh, not, not, not that one. Uh, let me do... Maybe more sunflowers? I don't know. I really don't. Um, how about we do something else instead? How do I close this? How? Okay, I'm just gonna do that. I'm trying to think about what else I could really do to make this work somewhat alright. I guess I can do that. And I guess that, cool. Maybe. Actually, no, I'm not gonna do that because I wanna I wanna use the the spike rock more. Because I haven't used it much. But also survival is probably the the best way of getting 8,000 sun. But probably not on this level. But because it has multiple rounds, we can get a lot more sun for longer. Also, I bought a rake. I finally did it. Since I have 70,000 gold or something like that that I can't spend on anything else other than maybe more gardening, I decided to actually spend it on something useful. Also, this area seems a lot greener than I remember for some reason. I don't know why, but it just seems more green than I remember. Going to do two columns of sunflowers. If I can. I'm going to upgrade them if I can as well. But we're going to need a lot of sun for the repeater to start off. And then even more for upgrading them. Just going to do that for the moment. Just going to take it very simply, starting off. Okay, we have enough for our first repeater. Just going to keep planting the sunflowers though, and then figure out where the next zombie is going to be. Top lot, top row. Okay. We should be pretty set now. Just need to start planting more things. And I might try and put in as many repeaters as possible before putting in the Gatling P. Gonna hold on for a second, even though I really want to do that upgrade. Need to take out the zombie first. Okay, let's do another one of those. Probably should have put it up there actually, but it's fine. For the moment. Gonna need some more sun, please. Just a little bit. There we go. Cool. Also, the moustache just drops off. As well as the glasses. Also, if I can get in the, the torchwood, that would also be great right now. I just don't know where to put it. Close to the other side as I can because I want to do as much damage as possible. Let me put it there, leave two rows or two columns for the zombies to have for themselves. Please take out the zombie before it eats the thing that I just put in. Thank you. That's probably not going to work, but that's fine. <laughs> My strategy is not a strategy at all, it's a lie. It worked though, so... Just need a lot more sun than I currently have. We're at the end of the first wave though. I'm 
Need to put in more repeaters as well. Okay, very nice. More zombies approaching. So now there are pole vaulters and the door zombies. I really wish I could keep the plants that I had selected. I don't think I need another sunflower, but just in case, I'm going to keep it, so. Let's activate those, grab that, grab that probably, grab that, maybe that. Probably that though. And let's go. I think. I just want to do something else. But I'd, I'd really need more sun to be able to do other stuff at the moment, so let's just go with this. They are coming. They are on their way. They're gonna get us. I <laughs> need to start planting more stuff. Torchwood. The torchwood is just going to maximize the damage straight away, so it's good to have those out there. And it's probably better to put out all of the repeaters before the Gatlings, so. Just because it costs slightly less. That's a problem. Not for much longer though. So let's take that out, thank you. Do that there. I need to do something about that, I'm in trouble. Please, 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 please. Oh boy. That's not good. Definitely not a good sign. Need to put out some spike weed, just in the back, I guess. Oh, the 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 rock, ro the spike rock is very tempting right now. Okay, interesting. This isn't actually a lot of power currently, but it will be once I have the Gatlings out. Okay, more zombies approaching. We have two flags completed so far. Now, I don't think I need the torchwood anymore, except one of them was also damaged, so I'm going to keep hold of that for a little bit longer, just to, just to make sure that everything will be alright. Definitely want to get the spike weed going a bit more. Uh, and I definitely want to put in tall nuts, I think. So let's rock. Gonna upgrade that. Let's also put in some more spike weed. Oh, hello, Buckethead zombie. I didn't actually pay attention to what new zombies there were, so that's probably gonna be a, my downfall. But our sun collection is doing quite nicely. Start putting in some of this stuff if I can, maybe. Except I really want to get the rest of the repeaters out there. But I need to hold on to my son to be able to do that. Top row is in trouble. Has an overload of zombies. Oh, hello. The football zombie. Gonna put that there for the moment while I collect some more sun to, to do something. I didn't place where I wanted to place, but that's okay. This round is definitely gonna go badly if I'm not too careful, except we're also at the end of the round apparently. Things are ramping up quite quickly. There. I'm probably just going to stick with this strategy the whole way through. K 
Okay, seems mostly the same. Let's just keep things together for the moment. Uh, what else do I need? I don't know. Just pick stuff, I guess. More sun, good stuff. Wait for the seeds to recharge while I do other stuff. Okay, that's all of the repeaters out there, so we can start upgrading them. Uh, but I still need more sun. Upgrade stuff. Which is getting pretty close to being fully uh, upgraded. Let me just put in some more spike, or the, the spike, spike rock? Spike rock. Yep. Spike rock. Oh, Gatling is very tempting. Let's do it. Start putting those in. It's going to take a while for that to recharge. Hello, football zombie. Another football zombie. I'm going to put that there to stop that. Okay. Another wave. And our sun is starting to go up, which is good, because I want to get the 8,000 sun. But I don't know if I'm going to get it on this level or not. Pro pro probably not. Gonna put that there to hopefully stop them. Just go all out with my stuff. <laughs> that face. <laughs> that face, though. Okay, it's gone, but that's fine. Okay, we've got a newspaper zombie now. Interesting. I think that's everything. Other than maybe that. It's fine. <laughs> that face, though, is brilliant. Everything's recharging. I guess that's a good thing. Also, the pool is going to be an interesting endless mode. Or survival mode. Just in general. Upgrade a few more things with pump pumpkins. Upgrade the spike weed. The spike rock. Survivals also gives you a lot of drops in special stuff. So if you need to get more plants for your Zen Garden, this is the place that you're probably gonna just get some. Things looking pretty good right now. Huge wave. I don't know how many flags there are in this right now. Put that one there. Since there are a couple of them with doors. The spike rocks go faster. Okay, that is just five flags. Okay. Well, I didn't get enough sun from that, but that's fine. We've unlocked another mode as well because we have another trophy. Survival fog. Oh boy. But we're up to survival night now, so let's do that. And see how this goes. Looks fairly simple so far. Also, yeah. Ah, uh, what do I want to work with? I don't really know. Probably want a potato mine, possibly. I grab that. I think stars is actually the way I want to go with this. Because stars are beautiful in this. So let's see... What else I can do? Um... I don't know what else to do right now. 
kind of tempted by a few things. Stars aren't going to be that good if I just use them by themselves. I think what I want to do though right now is actually do that. Just so we can get sun faster. Come on, do the thing. Okay. <laughs> I kind of like this because it feels like doing the adventure mode but it just goes by a lot faster. In a way. Some of these rounds are definitely, definitely a lot simpler though. That was a pretty bad move. Takes a while to recharge with the other one was already ready to be planted. Ceased to exist. <laughs> Some of these to these gravestones are really good. That one's a good one. It's only gonna save like a second though. Actually no, it's fine because I can actually plant another one right now. That was perfect. Okay. Now we just need to start planting in our uh, defense. So it can be a lot stronger. I should probably have done the skatey shroom. But that's okay. I can work on that. Um, how about I work, work on that right now? Because I don't like this. I'm going to fix things as time goes on. Seems all good. I think we might have a high chance of getting 8,000 sun in this just because... No, probably not actually. Probably about the same. It's actually probably worse in, this, in, the, in the night levels. For some reason I remember the, the sun shrooms giving me more sun than sunflowers. I don't know why, because that's definitely not the case. Unless I'm wrong again, which would be weird. fixed up. Now I can actually upgrade a few more things as well. Uh, also we're at the wave. Interesting. Very interesting. Oh, very interesting. Extremely interesting that that would work that way. Please take out the zombies. Please take out the zombies. Please take out the zombies. I'm gonna take out that grave. Oh, they took out one of my things. Let me just slow you down because you are bad. Please? This is not looking good. In that particular row for some reason. Mm, okay. If that's the way it's gonna be. Well, that's the first flag. Okay, and now we've got... These two. Ah, uh, let's do... I don't think I'm actually gonna need that. But that's fine. Um, let's do... A few things here. Do like that. Need to get through to the graves. Maybe some of that, maybe that. I don't know what else to put in. Uh, maybe some of this just to have some extra power. I don't know. It's gonna it's gonna be different. <laughs> I'm gonna work it out. Okay. I need to get rid of these gravestones. Uh, 
Seems pretty chill, though. not too much to worry about. Just need to make sure- I, I need to limit whether, uh, whether gravestones can spawn as well, because they will spawn in at the end of the round with an extra one. Uh, you don't go get to go that far, please. <laughs> I need to put in some stronger stuff. So if I can get a little bit more, I might be able to put in some gloom shrooms. Actually, gloom shroom right now. Please, thank you. I almost didn't do what I wanted it to, but it's fine. Things looking pretty good. I just want to get one more puff shroom in, in that spot there, just so so we can stop any extra things spawning in there. Ha, he, nope, that one there. We go, there we go. Cool. <laughs> Not letting anything else spawn in, in bad spots. <clears throat> so it should be pretty good. Please get the thing. Thank you. Now we just need to put in another gloom shroom somewhere some point. Plant with anything I can before the time goes to the next thing, even though it's going to keep the, the recharge going, so. Now, bucket heads. That's going to be a bit of a problem. So let's try and deal with that, I guess. Probably don't need to go too wild with stuff right now, but I'm going to put in whatever I can. Actually, magnet shrooms would be a good plan. Probably. Uh, if not, though, I can use Ice Shroom or anything else that I can. But Magnet Shrooms. Good stuff. Put that Bloom Shroom there. Okay. Also, I was going to put a Magnet Shroom there. I don't know why I put that... Good... The... 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 Fume Shroom there. There are too many Shrooms. I can't remember all the names of the, all the shrooms. It's fine. Also, I need to put in that there because there, there, there are many bucket heads. The bucket heads, there, there are many. <laughs> many bucket head. It's fine. Everything's fine. Just need to put that one there. Cool. I might be able to deal with them. Possibly. Also, I might want to put the... The magnet shrooms one further back gonna do that. Or even have two on each of the rows that have them. Could be a good strategy. Possibly, except I've messed it up several times now already. It's fine. I feel like I'm not doing enough damage. I don't know how to really do better, though. Because it's a nighttime level. I feel like maybe I'm just relying on the mushrooms too much. Fume shroom. Well, no, Gloom Shroom. I'm still getting that wrong. Okay. Do that one there. Then maybe... That one there. Let's see how this goes. Now, I'm assuming that each of these ones are going to be five flags. This one's... Almost halfway completed. We're basically halfway completed at this point. Oh, I took out the thing. That's a shame. It's fine. I'll deal with it. In a second. Like that. That shouldn't go away, probably. It's just a little bit concerning. Ah, uh, doors. Interesting. Very interesting. Uh, we're definitely going to need to change something up here. So let's get the spike weed out. Gonna keep the magnet shrooms around. Maybe I should get the stars. Maybe. What happens if I stop them from having any spots to have the graves? That's my question now. Because if I use the spike weed, I can probably do that. Oh, 
Oh boy. It's fine. There's just a few problems I'm seeing occurring. The defense is really just doing itself quite well. Might need to build backwards a little bit, though, with this whole thing. Let's put that there. And also, the, the fume shroom should be able to take out the door zombies on their own as well, in theory. Okay, let's build back a little bit further. Just try and keep everything filled in as much as I can. Also upgrade these, that'd be nice. So let's do that. Just do more damage quickly. I feel like I don't have enough sun for this. For some reason. Well anyway. Boy but no, that's not fair. That's not fair at all. Oh boy. That should not be allowed. Ah, uh, Cheating! They're cheating! I should have... I'd, I've made a horrible mistake. Oh boy. Having the... The spike weed out there and not having any spot for them to spawn in has made bad things happen. Very bad things happen. Very, very bad things. Oh boy, okay. There's a grave there now. I guess. Good thing we only have one more night to survive. One more part of the night. Uh, let me... Figure out how I want to do this better. Just better in general. Magnet shroom, maybe that, that, that... Um, I don't know. I guess I'll do that. Just to be able to freeze things. Gonna get rid of that as soon as possible. Just because I can. Maybe we should have left that row open and had the spike weed further back or something. It's fine. <laughs> Probably. I mean, we're doing so much damage anyway. If I had more of the uh, gloom shrooms, I probably could, have, could be fine. Probably. I just don't like that the grave can just spawn in, even if there's, there's stuff everywhere. I understand the necess how necessary it is, but also, still. It just bugs me. Uh, get rid of that football zombie, please. Pretty good. Okay, the final wave is on its way. Let's see where the grave's going to show up, because it has to show up, apparently. Over there. Okay, that's pretty, that's pretty good. Oh, hello, Disco Zombie. Well, this should be good. Don't think they can break through anything, so. And the gravestone keeps it symmetrical. That's how it works. Except for the, the stuff that I had to fix up a little bit. It's fine. It's all part of the symmetrical. You don't even know. It's so symmetrical. What is that madness? <laughs> that image is not making good. It's not making good. In fact, it's... it's breaking bad. <laughs> it's fine. I just realized that that was the opposite of... yeah, okay. Anyway, I think that is it for now, though, so thank you all for watching, and I'll see you all next time.